Good morning guys, I'm going to be vlogging today about what I eat in a day during quarantine here in this hotel room. This one will be far more interesting because now that my sister's brought me all of that stuff, I'm going to be making some meals in here so I will show you exactly what I will be making and what I eat in a day. Okay, first thing in the morning I'm going to have is a coffee. So at the moment I'm just using instant coffee. Almond milk. I am set. The next thing I'm going to have is some of this body bloom. I haven't tried it yet but Ellie loves it and she brought it yesterday so I'm going to make this part of my morning routine. Pre and probiotics good for digestion and for glowing smooth skin and I'm also going to mix in a little bit of this I've used Iron Vibes um, products for a while now so this is the collagen which is good for hair skin and nails so I'm going to mix the two of them <laughs> I'm going to prepare myself some BCAs, BCAAs, for while I work out. So Ellie sent me these ones. I haven't tried them before, but I'm sure they're going to be delicious. So I've got the BCAAs in here and I'm going to be drinking those while I work out. Um, it'll give me energy and keep me going and also make me hydrate way more because it tastes so good and my goal will be to get through this while I'm working out. But yeah, I like to intermittent fast every day and just because I'm here in hotel quarantine, I didn't want to change that. So yeah, I'm going to be having this while I do my workout and then I'll be having my breakfast. <laughs> So I'm finishing up my workout and I'm ordering a takeaway cappuccino on Uber Eats and it'll get delivered to my room. Yes, so I was just taking a shower and I could hear someone knocking and that was to tell me my coffee had arrived. So I'm going to have my cappuccino which is not so much a cappuccino anymore since getting delivered but it's still warm so I'm not complaining. Oh, Australian coffee. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to cook my breakfast and today I'm making oats. This is the first proper meal that I've prepared here and the first time I've ever made oats in a rice cooker. So bear with me, but I hope it works out. I'm gonna be using rolled oats, some peanut butter. I'm gonna mash a banana in it or maybe half a banana and put the other half on top. Some salt, cinnamon, almond milk and caramel protein. Okay, so I've got that in there. Make sure it's all immersed. And then I'm gonna start cooking it. So, maybe this one. So, slow cooker high is not the right setting. Rice steam. Look at it go. So it's getting a bit steamy in there and cooking so quick. I am a little bit nervous I'm gonna set off the fire alarm. But I've put it to slow cooker so that it just kind of simmers more because I do not want to set off the fire alarm. They did put a shower cap over the fire alarm. I think that's for this exact reason. So people don't 
set it off too easily because that would be a disaster. I'm gonna put a little bit of protein in, not too much. Just like, just a teaspoon. And I'm also gonna put in some of this peanut butter. This is the best peanut butter ever. It's my absolute fave. It's a New Zealand brand. I love it. I'm going to take this straight to the shower to rinse it, otherwise it's going to be a nightmare to clean up. Now I get to Blueberries. And my favorite berries ever, raspberries. I think this was a huge success. I'm way happier to eat something like this. this is what I would normally eat for breakfast. So while I'm in here, I'm gonna be eating what I normally eat and making sure it's super healthy and super clean. Okay, so for my lunch today, I'm going to make a toasted sandwich. I have a sandwich press here and I'm gonna be putting on it some inside my sandwich, some truffle cheddar cheese, which I had some with my dinner last night. It is so yummy. And then I'm going to put some tomatoes in and also avocado. So it's an avocado cheese and tomato toasty. I'm gonna to be using baking paper on top of the toasting machine just to prevent any unnecessary cleaning. I'm literally cutting cheese up with a butter knife. Now, salt and pepper. Yum, I'm gonna just spin it so that it's evenly flat. Okay, I think it's ready. Oh. Okay, I have finished my toasty. Steaming. I think it's gonna be really good because of the truffle cheese. I love truffle, so. Meal number two I've cooked, nailed it. If I could give myself any critique to make it better, if I had some butter and buttered the outside of the bread before toasting it, would have made it extra tasty, but this is healthier, so. And then because I'm still a little bit hungry, I'm going to snack on some Cobb's popcorn while I watch the sunset. Popcorn is one of my favorite snacks and it's also a healthy snack. So eat all the popcorn you want. Some of my friends in the ute there, they're coming to drop me off some cervello. <laughs> <laughs> they can see me. It's so weird that they're like just there, but I'm all the way here and I can't say hi. So I just had a delivery come from two of my best friends, Soph and Jay. And when the guy came to my door from the army, he was like, somebody loves you. And he was holding this. It is so sweet. She made homemade soup with her dad in the kitchen yesterday and homemade bread. And then I have a bottle of red wine, chocolate bullets, sparkling water, and a face mask. 
This is so thoughtful. I, I honestly have the best friends and family ever. Okay, so for dinner tonight, I'm having soup that I said before my friend brought me, a glass of red wine and some homemade bread. I'm gonna heat the soup up in my rice cooker. So I poured about half of the soup into the pot. I'm gonna put it on that one. And I also have freshly homemade bread. I'm gonna heat it up over here in the sandwich press. That is so quick. Rice cookers, I think, are my new favorite thing. All right, I'm ready. Some fresh parsley. I am feeling so cozy and lucky. Cheers to night three in hotel isolation. This is my best dinner yet. So I'm going to wrap this video up here. I'm going to watch an episode of 13 Reasons Why and then head to bed. Normally I'd have a cup of tea and a little sweet something, but I had that licorice earlier, so I've got my sweet fix in. Uh, I had so much fun making this video for you guys. Being stuck in a room, it really gave me some purpose of something to do today. So I'm going to try and edit this up and get it up for you guys while I'm still in here. And then I'm also going to be working on some more videos, maybe like some workout ones, more like day in the life and ideas of things to keep busy because I think a few of you are really interested. Maybe you're going to be going into quarantine soon yourself. So hopefully I gave you guys some ideas of things to make and eat while you're in here and a bit of an insight of what it's actually like. Um, so I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.